Well, a doctor from Ottawa Hills is using social media to try to spread awareness about a very serious topic. Steve Iwanek sat down with him and his family to talk about how they're turning tragedy into something positive. Steve? Yeah. Jeff and Mel, Dr. Brian Hefflinger is a neurosurgeon who works for Mercy Health in Toledo. His son, Brian, was 18 when he died after drinking and getting behind the wheel. His family is not making excuses. Instead, they're using this deadly crash to spread awareness. Well. I haven't seen the comments happen. Ryan Hefflinger and his son Kevin started making TikToks in June of 2022. I'm a neurosurgeon and I live in Toledo, Ohio. I've been a full-time neurosurgeon now for 23 years. At the beginning, it was all about learning about Brian's background as a neurosurgeon. But then he began to share a story of tragic loss. Losing somebody you love is one of the worst experiences you can have in life. Hefflinger's son, Brian, had been drinking at a party on February 2nd, 2013. He took the keys and tried to drive home, despite pleas for him to stop. And I hear him telling me not to be mad or not to, you know, they didn't mean it, Mom, or I, it was just an accident. I just hear his voice. I could just tell from what they said to me. I mean, I'm the attending trauma surgeon for neurosurgery that night, and they won't talk to me. I just, I knew Brian was dead. Data from the Ohio Highway Patrol from the last five years shows 3,160 deadly crashes in Ohio due to OVI. Nearly 3,500 people have died. The effects are the bitter reality for so many families, and the Hefflingers are trying to make sure their son's memory is used for good. For me, it's, I don't know, whenever you get comments from people about how impactful it was for them, it, it definitely gives you energy and motivates you. So it's definitely hard, but also in a way, it's therapeutic. I've always thought keeping my brothers, by talking about my brother and using him as a positive force for good, that uh, keeps his memory alive and it, uh, I still feel very close to him. Hefflinger's TikTok page has grown to be nationally recognized. Over 500,000 followers and 11 million likes. An account that attempts to humanize a doctor's life, both the good and the painful. I think that's what it's all about is like, you know, sending a message that maybe educates people to make better decisions, a better awareness of it. You're not going to save the world. You're not going to change everybody's mind. But I'll tell you, there are people out there who listen that it will change their minds. And we've seen that. The Hefflingers told me they plan on continuing to make content and to grow the presence online. You can follow their account on TikTok by searching at Dr. Hefflinger. Reporting in studio, Steve Iwanek, WTOL.